these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. But what I need is proof. I can't take your word on this. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Have you decided how to tell him? I don't know. A text message is so impersonal. Fierce fight continues as the Reapers occupy most of the planet. It appears that Tyrion forces may lose their planet. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All permission to the Reapers. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Who's that spying on me now? Ah, uh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. <laughs> oh, yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. You have to move on. And I will, once all my enemies are dead. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Saying my second in command is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Commander Shepard. General Araka, I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. Yes, neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now, reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal, see? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top-end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with a bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. So I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. So, what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and then spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. 
then I'm happy to share my top stock with CSEC, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Get ready for trouble. Not here for that, Sane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Sane, you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. Commander.
Commander. The Salarian Dalatras and Krogan clan chief are ready to come aboard. Have them brought to the conference room. And hope this doesn't start another war. The Krogan is in no position to make demands. The Krogan has a name. Erdnot Rex. And I'm not just some junkyard Varen you unleash whenever you're in trouble. I've got my own problems. Reaper scouts have arrived on Tuchunka. So why should I care if a few Turians go extinct? Trying to draw out negotiations will get you nowhere, Rex. I have no time for it. Just tell us what you want. I'll tell you what I need. A cure for the genophage. Absolutely not. The genophage is non-negotiable. Why are you so opposed to the idea, Dalatress? Because my people uplifted the Krogan. We know them best. You mean you used us to fight a war you couldn't win? It wasn't the Salarians or the Asari or even the Turians that stopped the Rachni. It was Krogan blood that turned the tide. And after that, you ceased to be useful. The Genophage was the only way to keep your urges in check. Dalatrash, you may not like him, but Rex is right. Insulting him won't change that. I won't apologize for speaking the truth. We uplifted the Krogan to do one thing, wage war. It's all they know because it's all we wanted them to know. Your people should have thought the matter through then. Was it really a surprise the Krogan revolted? That's precisely my point, Commander. We made a rash decision. We turned to the Krogan in desperation. It's the same mistake you're about to make today. No good can come from curing the Genophage. The Krogan have paid for their mistakes. The Genophage has gone on long enough. 1,476 years, if you're keeping track. It was a thousand years of peace, free from these brutes. Enough! Whether or not they deserve a cure is academic. It would take years to formulate one. My information says otherwise. A Salarian scientist, Malin, grew a conscience. He was on my planet, testing a cure on our females. I remember. 
His methods were barbaric. But what you didn't know is that other females survived his experiments. So the Dalatress here sent in a team to clean up the whole mess and to take them prisoner. Where did you get this? It, it could be a fabrication. Don't insult me. Those are my people. They're immune to the genophage, and you're going to give them back. Dalatras, is this true? How will curing the genophage benefit my people? How long do you think you'll last alone against the Reapers? Because if you don't help, that's how it'll end up. And I'll be the last friendly Turian you ever see. What's it gonna be? The females are being kept at one of our STG bases on Sirkash. But I warn you, Commander. The consequences of this will be felt for centuries to come. Will be nothing compared to what happens if the Reapers win. Let's get the females. You're not setting foot on Sirkesh. This will take time. It happens now. As a Council Spectre, Shepard can oversee the exchange. We're going. I won't forget this, Commander. A bully has few friends when he needs them most. This is the Solarian homeworld we're headed to. They aren't used to seeing Krogan here, so let's keep it simple. We land, get the females, and leave before anyone changes their mind. I still don't trust a word they say. Let diplomacy play out, Rex. You'll get what you want. These females are the best, and probably last hope for my people. We'll bring them back, Rex. Don't worry. I appreciate that, Liara. I wouldn't want anyone else along for the ride. <coughs> I suppose I can make room for you too, Garrus. <laughs> Figured you'd gone soft sitting on your throne. Forgot how to hold a gun. Commander, I have the Solarian base on sensors. Set her down.
Commander, Solarian ground control says we don't have clearance to land. Tell them the Dolatress authorized this herself. I knew they'd never keep their word. Let's see them try to stop a Krogan airdrop. Rex! We have an unauthorized landing. And who authorized you to hold my race hostage? For a few moments ago. I'd like to avoid a diplomatic incident. As would we. But you have something valuable to Rex. Something worth dying for. This matter can be resolved, but I must insist he remain under guard. <clears throat> I can handle this, Rex. If anything goes wrong and all bets are off. I'm Paddock Wicks, and I appreciate your understanding, Commander. With war on everyone's minds, our people are on edge. Careful! Watch the containment shield! I'd hope to never see one of those again. As you can see, this base contains sensitive information. What kind of work goes on here? Evolutionary trials, morphological simulations, exogenetic assessments. Nothing is ever simple with Solarians, is it? Science has always been our best defense. The research we do here has kept Sirkesh safe for millennia. Does that include studying lost Krogan? The females were in poor health when we found them on Tuchanka. They were brought here to stabilize their condition. This old planet smells wrong. I'd like to see them. Of course. I'll need to clear you for the lower levels. Give me a few moments and meet me near the elevator. Agree with them or not, our orders are clear. Ensure the smooth handover of the Krogan detainees. Who gave the order? Our superiors. That's all that matters. But they're gonna cure the genophage. Everything we've done to stop the Krogan will be for nothing. When I want your opinion, I'll promote you. Until then, stay sharp and keep your mouth shut. This is a restricted area. Please stay back. Commander Shepard, it's Major Kirihi. I'd heard you were coming. Good to see you again. Sounds like you've been promoted. Yes, due in no small part to our mission on Vermine. Hold the line. You saved my men that day. Good to see a friendly face, Major. Garrus Vicarian. Always a pleasure. And same to you, Dr. Tassoni. Major. It seems the Reapers have a way of bringing us together. How did you get posted to this base, Major? I led the team on Tachanka that found the females. Nasty business. Malin may have meant well, but his operation was crude. Test subjects were unaccounted for. The females easily escaped his lab. What do you think about bringing the female Krogan here? Our scientists say it's important to preserve the females. Evolutionary paradigms. I say when people know you're hiding something valuable, they'll want to steal it. Either way, I have my orders. They'll be your problem soon enough. I guess we're both still feeling the effects of Vermeer. Yes, ironic. You destroyed the genophage cure, yet now it's the key to an alliance. Your standoff with Erdnot Rex is legend within STG. I'm sure you saw Rex's entrance. Our colony's three systems away saw it. Yes, and he's rather angry about the security arrangements. Apologies, but better that than a Krogan with a shotgun wandering the base. Think of all the casualties. Our med pay couldn't handle it. Are the Solarians prepared for war with the Reapers? I've heard what they're doing to your Earth. I'm not sure any species can prepare for that. Though rumors suggest you're building a superweapon of some kind. This business with the females is part of it. I need the Turian support, and they need the Krogans. Which is why I never became a diplomat. 
Too much hand holding. Leave it to the Dalatressa. Security seems high. Are you expecting trouble? Our motto in STG is to always expect trouble. Failing that, create trouble for someone else. Our enemies have the same idea. Nice seeing you again, Major. Likewise. And Commander, regardless of what the politicians decide, you can count on my support retaking Earth. You'd do that? Consider it my way of returning a favor. It would be an honor to fight alongside you again. Good day. A cipher analyst over in Intel told me the jury is... This is where all you Solarians come from, huh? No wonder you're so soft. Too busy writing poetry about waterfalls. Shepard, I don't like this. I should be the one going in. How about you stay here and we only fight one war at a time? That was just good old-fashioned Krogan hot air. If it had been real, they'd be dead. Who tipped you off about the females here? Sorry, Shepard, but they're listening to every word we say. I prefer my Salarian liver served raw. <laughs> Besides, you'd think this is the kind of thing the Shadow Broker would have known about. Too bad I don't know him. Or her. I'm sure the Broker was very busy. Back on the Normandy, you said Reapers were sighted on Tachanka. Clans Jorgal and Rabinor sighted a few landing parties. The Reapers are up to something. Tuchunka may be a pile of radioactive rubble, but it's our pile. And we'll fight the last Krogan to keep it that way. That's what I always liked about you, Rex. My smoldering good looks? <laughs> there is that. But you've never given up. And that determination's about to pay off. Yeah. Who would have thought back on Vermeer we'd be standing here doing this together? What do you know about these females? They weren't fertile, so we used them as decoys to draw off enemies from the ones who were. But Malin's experiments changed that. These damn piejacks stole them right out from under us. That's a pretty brutal way to treat your women, Rex. The females suggested it. We've had to make a lot of tough choices to ensure we don't all die off. What a horrible way to live. It's just one more thing that'll get better when the genophage is cured. Are the Krogan ready to fight the Reapers? Ever since Sovereign showed up, I figured this day would come. My people have spent too much time selling ourselves out as mercenaries. Now we can get back to doing what Krogan do best. Saving everyone else from giant monsters. Never going to let us forget about the Rachni Wars, are you? The last time I was at the Citadel, I didn't see a Turian statue in your honor. <laughs> Just wait till this war is over. It's been good talking to you again, Rex. It'll be even better when we have a few Solarians for lunch. Another incursion? You have clearance now to see the females, Commander. I hope we can resolve this matter without reenacting the Krogan rebellions. What do you think about handing over the Krogan? I differ from most of my colleagues. Curing the Genophage will bring closure to this issue. In the future, the Krogan may yet play some role we can't even imagine. We should let the evolutionary process decide who lives and dies, not galactic politics. Thanks for your time. Of course. Proceed into the elevator when you're ready. Now take this elevator down and someone will... What's happening? Sensors have picked up activity on the perimeter. Hurry, Commander. Someone will meet you below.
All specimens are accounted for, sir. Shepard, excellent timing. Good to have you here. Morton. Eyesight still sharp. Surprise, understandable. Hadn't expected to return to work. You're back with STG. Special consultant. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Helped female Krogan. Fed information to Clan Erdnot. Encouraged political pressure to free female. You must be Rex's inside source. Yes. Can explain later. Security warnings not normal. Need to get off world for sake of Krogan. Females had weakened immune systems. Side effect of Malin's cure. These... didn't survive. But what about Malin's research? I thought we saved it. Indeed. Data saved, but not complete. Lacks crucial details to reconstruct cure, but still useful for synthesizing from living tissue. Couldn't save them. I'm sure you did everything you could, Morton. Arrived too late. Cannot delay now. One survivor, immune to genophage, can synthesize cure from her tissue. She's still here? Yes, last hope for Krogan. If she dies, genophage cure... Problematic. Please be careful. Krogan's slow to trust. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Are you here to kill me? Goddess, what she's been through... Erdnot, Rex, and I are here to take you home. Why? What am I to you? Have the Solarians been mistreating you? Those are my sisters you saw back there. They died in a lot of pain. Did the best we could. And now I know I'm the only one left. That makes me dangerous to a lot of people. What about you, Commander Shepard? Why are you here? You're the future of the Krogan race. I'm fighting for that. Then I hope you brought an army. Alert. Unidentified vessels have breached the barrier. Give me an update. Outbound communications have been severed. We're cut off. Secure all data to off-site location. What's happening? We have multiple ships inbound. Shepard, it's Rex. Cerberus troops are attacking the base. Get the females out of there now! Only one survived, Rex. It might be safer down here. What? So the Solarians can kill her like the others? No deal. If you still want this alliance, get her out of there. Release the female. We're leaving. I can't. Protocol states during lockdown, no specimens. Objection noted. Now, please release Krogan. Need to monitor pod as it clears quarantine procedures. Meet us at next checkpoint, Shepard. Likely Cerberus opposes Genophage cure. You'll see Tachanka again. I promise. Get your elevator, Shepard. Put all research subjects into immediate lockdown. They are insecure. Watch us secure. Beyond subjects. We have a problem. What sort of problem? Security overrides on responding. We've got to get moving. Log, Morton Solus, 162.3. Log, Morton Solus, 162.3. Used STG ties to secure station here. Gained autonomy in caring for Krogan test subjects. Females were obviously dying. Barbaric experiments. Malin's fault. My responsibility to fix. Need to save them. No more. No more dead. Something's wrong with the elevator. It's not responding. There. Try it now, Commander. Oh, crap. Get back! Is there another way out of here? Other side of the lab. An emergency exit. I can open it from here. Shepard, Cerberus Force is trying to locate female. Quarantine checkpoint under attack. Hurry! Shepard, it's Rex. I took the shuttle. Do whatever it takes to get the female up to the landing pad. I'll try to make life miserable for Cerberus. This looks weird.
Obviously, they've never had to fight a Yogg face to face. Shadow Broker. Could have sworn he was muttering to Sony the whole time. Not funny. Are you okay? Containment shield is holding. We'll try to repair if necessary. Can't speak for Krogan's health, however. I'm fine, Commander. Females kept secret. Possibly a mole in the STG. Could be indoctrinated. If no Krogan alliance with Turians, Reapers left unchallenged. We'll do more than challenge them. Shepard, meet us at next checkpoint. Server is likely to target. Cerberus isn't fooling around. They're capable of anything. Commander, stay back. Hostiles just down the hall. Is there an easier way around? You could say that. Cerberus must have been tipped off. They got here too fast. Every war has its traitors. Take the high ground. 
変えるラブだ There must be a power conduit nearby. Isn't your problem, Commander? You don't know me. But I'd like to. Hang in there. How many more checkpoints? Just the landing area. Pope heard not Rex still waiting. Rex can't keep his hands off a fertile female. He'll be there. I'll see you up top.
now, Shepard. Shepard, you must authorize release. Pod then transfers to loading area. Let's get you out of there. Exactly mellowed with age, has he? Shepard, I think you did it. Looks clear from here. I'm coming in now. Let's make this quick. Let's get you out of there. I can handle myself, Rex. Women. Why is Cerberus here? What do you want? Commander, I'm hearing chatter you're brokering a treaty between the Krogan and the Turians. If I get Krogan boots on Palavin, the Turians promise me their support. And how does Cerberus get involved? I don't know. The elusive man is up to something. Then keep them at bay. I can't overstate what a victory this treaty would be for the Alliance. We'll need all the help we can get. How's the Prothean device coming? Alliance R&D has officially begun construction. The team has dubbed it Project Crucible. We're throwing everybody who knows how to hold a hammer at it. This is gonna be the most ambitious undertaking in human history. Will we get it done? I'm not saying it won't be a challenge, but our researchers tell me the designs are elegant, massive in scope, but strangely simple as well. We can do this, Shepard. You can do this. Never doubt that. No, sir. Good, hack it out.
You have the female, Rex. A cure for the rest of your people can come later. That wasn't the deal. But Palavin needs your reinforcements now. We can't delay. Unless every Krogan gets the cure, there's no alliance. Morton, how long will it take to finish a cure? Need to synthesize base antigen from female. Also requires healthy male Krogan tissue. We'll need a sample. You're looking at it. Acceptable. We'll need you to remain aboard Normandy for a procedure. Uh, let's hope the food's gotten better. Formulating a cure that works for every Krogan sounds like a tall order, Morden. Can you do it? Of course. Similar to Genophage Modification Project. Working against own alterations this time. Not as simple as garbage DNA blocking attachment sites. We'll need to counteract shutdown of redundant nervous system, adjust our transmitter levels. Got it. We'll create cure, Shepard. Don't need to worry. Then get started, Morden. And make it quick. Always do. We'll be in Med Bay if you'd like to speak more. Eve requires tests. Eve? Female's real name unknown. Normandy, a human vessel. Human mythology seemed appropriate under circumstances. Suggest speaking with her. New perspective. Surprising in Krogan. Now, is there anything else? There's a small matter concerning a ship we've lost contact with. What happened? I'd rather discuss it... in private. Turian problems can't even come close to what I've got. What is it? Some of my men went missing. The rest of it we can discuss... somewhere else. I'll find you both in the war room. Just be ready to talk. Commander. You said one of your ships had gone missing? Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. Our ship went down on Tuchanka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are your men doing there? I'm sorry. That's classified. But it's vital they be rescued. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of... galactic peace. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help, and understanding. Your men that crashed on Tachunka. How many are there? A platoon. You said their mission was a matter of galactic peace. Why? I'm sorry, Commander. As I said, it's highly classified. Look, if you want me to put my ass on the line, I need answers. I can't tell you. Please understand. The Commander is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. He'll be your contact. Victus? My son. I needed someone I could trust completely. The Salarian Dalatras was worried about what the Krogan will do once they're cured. How do you feel? It won't matter if we don't stop the Reapers, but I understand her doubts. The moon you found me on? That's where we made our last stand against the Krogan during the rebellions. They were that relentless. How did it turn out? The Krogan started using asteroids as weapons, directing them against our colonies. We had no choice. The Genophage was our last resort. So yes, Krogan intentions after this war will be a serious concern, but I'd rather have a grateful ally than a resentful enemy. Reaching out to the Krogan for help must be difficult for you. We can't allow the mistakes of our past to cloud the future. Your race and mine were once enemies. The first contact war, as you call it. I was there, dodging shells fired by your navy. But look at us now, standing in a ship of Turian human design, working together. That's all. Of course, Commander.
Hell of a show down there on Sir Kesh. Just like the old days, Shepard. Right down to me pulling your ass out of the fire. I was the one with bullets flying at me. And I gave you the moral support to dodge them. Uh-huh. You said one of your squads is missing? They were scouting out the Rachni Relay. We've heard rumors of trouble in the area. Rachni? Thought that might get your attention. I have a favor to ask. It's big. Don't tell me they're back. All I know for sure is our scouts went silent as soon as they arrived. I've got Arlac Company, my best unit, on standby. You give the word, and I'll meet you there. I'll see what I can do. Get on it, Shepard. What will you do after the Genophage is cured? Once we deal with the Reapers, most Krogan will want to settle a score with the Turians and Salarians. I won't let them. That isn't our path forward. This time will be different. A lot of people will be relieved to hear that. No one wants to repeat history. They know we'd probably win this time. But war has never brought us anything except misery. It's time to focus on rebuilding. What's the situation back on Tachanka? I'm still getting scattered reports of Reaper forces arriving. Something big is brewing. I won't let those things take Tuchanka. Not when we're about to cure the Genophage. My people have had enough bad luck in our time. Back on Sirkesh, it looked like the female Krogan could hold her own. Our females don't lack for spirit. For males, a good show of force sorts things out. But females like to talk about it. Then think about it. <sighs> then talk about it some more. Women have good ideas, Rex. You should listen. Yeah, but they have so many of them. So sometimes I pretend to listen and... Well, let's just say Krogan females have tempers, too. How could there be trouble with the Rachni? They were all but extinct. The last queen promised to disappear forever or be destroyed. I know, I was there. I've got a bad feeling about this. It may not be Rachni, but maybe it is. Could be another invasion. If they're crawling out from under some rock, you know how bad it could get. We need to stop them. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. And Shepard, I like what you've done with the Normandy. Got tired of always hanging around the cargo bay before. I still don't have a window like Liara does, but it's progress. Wish I could knock some heads around with you, but duty calls. If the Solarian says my DNA is important, who am I to argue? Secured better. Nah, they were solid. Cerberus has Reaper tech. Compared to those upgrades, the Salarians might as well have been throwing rocks. Commander, we've got new reports of Cerberus activity on Tachanka. I've marked it on the galaxy map. Commander, nice to see you again. How are you settling in, trainer? I actually feel somewhat useful. It's been challenging to integrate data feeds for the War Summit. How are the systems holding? Well, I'm glad we performed stress tests. Specialist trainer has been extremely helpful. The accuracy of our war room data is a direct result of her work. Thank you, Edie. I'm still getting used to all of this. In the lab, we'd hoard everything, piles of tech everywhere. Out here, it's like living out of a shoebox. Life on an active ship always feels crowded at first. You'll get used to it. Oh, it's not a bad thing. I've got no problems getting cozy. <laughs> this is wonderful. Back in the lab, we had to hoard because we had no budget. Now? Edie, Ariaki Tech uses a proprietary smart processing algorithm that could clean up our long-range data. Can we license it? We can. Analyzing and applying the upgrade now. The algorithm should reduce long-range strategic combat data analysis time by 3%. Impressive. If it means getting the equipment I need, I can quite happily live out of a shoebox. Commander, I've set up a secure communications with the Turian and Salarian governments and added their combat data to our boards. Hopefully it'll give us some idea of what's going on.
Krogan and the Turians really should get behind the Alliance. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die, and... Now that's about it. So, bringing the Krogan to a war summit went well. You want me to invite the Batarians too, or the Vorcha? Building alliances is the only way we stand a chance against the Reapers. Yeah, but the Krogan? I'd feel better if we had a tighter plan, like time travel or teaching the Reapers to love. Still, good to have Morden back. The bad guys shouldn't get the monopoly on mad scientists. It is good you came by. I have questions about the genophage. You and everyone else. What do you need, Edie? A Krogan female of breeding age can produce clutches of up to 1,000 fertilized eggs over the course of a year. There are over 1 billion females on Tachanka. If even 1% become fully fertile, they can birth 10 billion infants. On Earth, bugs have a lot of young, too. Most of them die. The attrition rate would naturally be high, but the state has an interest in keeping the children alive for warfare purposes. Any other cheerful thoughts? Logistics. Even were they to side with us, transporting the Krogan to the battlefields of Palavin could prove difficult. They have been demilitarized. That is, they have no warships. What do you suggest? They will need Turian or civilian starships to carry them to battle. With your permission, I will make the necessary calls to have these ships in place for when you deliver the Krogan. Do it. Anything else? Food. They will be unable to eat anything on Palavin. They must bring their own or rely on the nutrients in their humps. This keeps getting better and better. The Krogan will also require sedatives, since Krogan fight with others of their kind in enclosed spaces such as starships. Make it happen. Are there any last things you're worried about? Nothing that demands your attention, Shepard. abduction on my worst enemy. But it's behind me now. I'm fine. But it makes me think of Earth and all the other Reaper-occupied worlds. What are the Reapers doing to the people who live on all those worlds? As we sit here, enjoying our coffee. How many souls are in agony this very moment? Millions? Billions? Go, oh, Greg. <laughs> I lied. I'm not fine. Everything okay in the med bay? Yes. Morden would just like some space to work with Eve. He kicked you out? Oh, no. I just felt I was getting in his way. I'll return when I'm needed. Hello, Commander. Shepard, they say female Krogan have a thing for guys with scars. So I've heard. I've got a few, myself. Here's hoping nobody's planning an arranged marriage to cement this deal. Though I have to say, I admire Eve. The things she must have endured living with the genophage. And now, to top it all off, she's her people's last hope. Imagine the pressure. It takes real courage to face that. I hope we can measure up. will work, Rex. We just need to finish building the Crucible. Although I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. Wasn't that hard. Lucky you keep its location more secret than the fact it exists. And I'm sure you'll do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. <laughs> My lips are sealed.
Ready for the next mission? Enjoy your day. Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. Garrus loyal, reasonably intelligent, bit aggressive, almost like Krogan. For the third time, Doctor, I'm not interested. Ah, Shepard. We were just... Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful, or put any faith in Solarian. Doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? Kind that ends the genophage. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive, also affecting comfort of patient. He was your inside source, Rex. You can trust him. Solarians have minds like a maze. You never know when they're leading you into a trap. Trap? Eve's released my doing. Would never have known about her if not for me. That was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility, her welfare a priority. Will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> you got a quad, Doctor. Keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Don't forget, still need your tissue sample. I'll be back. Common phobia. Fear of needles. Or Solarian doctors. Now have work to do. Prefer females of the species. Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. We owe a lot to you, even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. I feel bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered it the day I became a shaman of the female clan. I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. I didn't realize the Krogan had female shamans. Wisdom comes from pain, and the genophage has made us very wise. Rather than surrender to despair, a few of us chose to preserve the ancient ways. We safeguard our culture, our knowledge, our secrets. So when our children live again, the Krogan will flourish. How were you initiated? You're locked in a cave for seven days with just enough food to last. On the eighth, you'll starve. What does that prove? Your resolve. Every acolyte is given a chance. You either claw your way out through the rock with your bare hands, or you die. How did you make it out alive? I started digging the wrong way. I was in complete darkness. Nothing other than my own heartbeat to sustain me. What happened? I found this. A simple crystal, but it became my chisel. Take it as a reminder, Commander. In the darkest hour, there is always a way out. That's a brutal initiation. But an illuminating one. You learn to appreciate the light by living in the dark. What do you think of Rex? When he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong leader. I know in his heart Rex wants what's best for us, though not all the other clans see it that way. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And that you can tell him. Do you think Rex will want revenge for the genophage? Some clans will expect it, but I hope Rex resists. He understands the cycle of violence must end if Krogan are ever to have a voice in galactic politics. Still, he's just one Krogan. If enough clans demand it, he may not be able to stop them. If you don't mind me asking, what's it been like living with the genophage? I knew sisters who couldn't bear the shame of being infertile. They would wander off into the wastelands, hoping a thresher maw would kill them and end their torment. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Yes. After my first stillborn. 
What kept you from ending your own life? When my child didn't draw breath, that's when my life truly began. The genophage forces us to live on hope alone. There is nothing else. There is no reason to exist other than the hope that the next day will bring change. And if it doesn't, there is always the next. How do you think things will change after the genophage is cured? Our species will find its balance again. Females will help shape the future, like in the ancient days, before we were just pawns of power-hungry males. Most seem hell-bent on shooting anything that looks at them wrong. What else is there for them to do? Because of the genophage, they become wandering killers, seeking targets to justify their existence, excuses to earn them honor. How did you get involved in Malin's experiments? The other females and I volunteered. We heard Malin was trying to cure the genophage for Clan Werelock. Aren't they a rival clan? Rivalries are the invention of the males. Under their rule, Tachanka has laid in ruins for over a thousand years. It's time females took back our place in society and resurrected our future. Malin was our best hope. Would you go to Malin again? Absolutely. It only takes one candle to light a fire, and then the darkness is no more. I'm sorry none of the other females survived. I know. The youngest one, Kern, was the last to go. But she knew she would enter the void free of this curse, and then smile when she looked down upon the children of Tachonka. Her spirit will be the midwife to my firstborn. I found Malin's lab. It looked like a dungeon. His experiments were brutal. We learned that too late. He meant well, but his methods grew more barbaric as he went. We finally escaped into the rubble. Eventually, a Salarian team found us. They saved our lives. We were so sick. How has Morton been treating you? Better than Krogan males do. He's not like a typical Salarian. No, no, no. Organ redundancy results in new period before metaphase. Can't alter that. Damage to telomeres, premature aging. He does that. But I sense pain in him, too. He told me about his work on the genophage. I should consider him an enemy. Yet I think seeing my sisters and I changed something in him. A sorry Borcha offspring have an allergy to dairy and... Well, it wasn't his ear. Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. I've only met a few humans in my time. I'm glad for the opportunity. Shepard, blood work complete. Indicate significant stress on Eve's system. Malin's data thorough. Fortunately, detailed as well. Have used notes to improve her condition. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity, totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect, health trouble. You think you can make this work for all Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well, tune hormone production, long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. So, we did the right thing by saving the data? Indeed. Would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tachunka? Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. So the end justifies the means? Not my means. But you're using the data, encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. Will always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can help Eve. Can cure genophage. Won't ignore data vital to her survival because of unethical origins. Any word on Malin himself? No. Ordered teams to search for him when trying to help Eve. Nothing so far. Large galaxy. Lots of places to hide. Could already be dead for all we know. Would kill him now, if possible. Unless he could help. How is she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her? My patient, my responsibility. Found her at STG base. Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. 
You've always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turians doomed without Progen support. Progen need unified threat, outlet for aggression, cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left, but still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong? Possibly. Stakes too high for inexperience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right, to prove I can. Nice talking with you, Morden. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure, work against collectors, decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny, sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. You'd go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. Don't download it. You're saying we don't need Terra Nova. Lose one colony, save five. That's the math. You know what the commander did for us? The colony? Yes. I was on a little thing called the news. You think you can fly on this ship, sit next to us at chow time, and then broadcast something like that? That's traitorous. Hey, it's just an opinion piece. You don't like it, don't download it. You're saying we don't need Terra Nova. Lose one colony, save five... Lose the peace, or lose your spot on this ship, Allers. This is exactly what I was afraid of. Thanks, Commander. What's your choice, Allers? Like you said, it's just your opinion, right? I'll pull it. Silicon polymers, ultra light harmonic phased power cells. Mm hmm. And if she ever accidentally walks into a wall, there's just so much padding. Ugh, I knew it. Wish I were a wall. You pretty much are, Kenneth. Commander, thank you. Power grid is, is great to me. Feels good to be in an Alliance uniform again. Welcome aboard, Chief. so interested in my people, Asari. Protheans are always an enigma, a mystery to solve. I wanted to know what happened to your civilization. Why did such an enlightened race disappear? Enlightened? Well, it seemed that way. And now that I am here? I wonder what it's like waking up 50,000 years later to a new galaxy. I believe this cycle cares too much about what other species think. Krogan, Turian, Solarian, all were primitives in my time. What good does their help do now? We can't win this war on our own. Then demand their help. Do not indulge their selfish requests. What will saving one Krogan matter? If only it were that simple. If they get in your way, destroy them. Excuse me? I apologize. The previous occupant of this room left traces of himself. I have absorbed some of them. Yes, Grunt. He was a strong one. Maybe it's best if I let you recover. That would be best.
what the hell Cerberus was up to on Sarkesh. 